Okay, boss fam, I just want to go through here and show you guys what's going on. So I finally got my inks in and I got my printer going and I have absolutely, I had absolutely no idea how to clean this thing, how to do anything because you look online and you see a whole lot of people saying they've converted everything, but you don't see them showing you really, you know, like how, okay, once I get everything in there, how do I go? and do a head cleaning what do I do so these are the things that I'm gonna do um, as we go through but right now y'all I did find this and so I kept looking kept looking trying to figure out how to do a head cleaning I found this I have no idea what this means but I do see a lot of missing lines so I'm assuming that something needs to be clean I'm assuming that something is missing there I don't know if there's supposed to be some white ink down here. I don't know. So I'm going to be searching and searching YouTube videos trying to find somebody at least doing a showing a nozzle check because I can't find it. Um, so I was not able to get this thing to print with the film that I have. So I put my regular screen printing film off in here and I'm doing like a Mickey Mouse design I don't have the white turned all the way up I just want to just do something just to see because I'm just trying to see do I got a head cloth I can't even tell right so um I have no idea so this is the design that's coming out which is Minnie Mouse on my paper i'm just trying to figure this out as i go y'all so what i did is i just uploaded a couple of designs in here and this is the mini mouse and i guess it has a square behind it that i don't know about that's white right i guess so so anyways um i sent this thing to print because i could not figure out anything so, I don't know. Maybe I'll go live and tomorrow and see what I can do. But I'm gonna, I got 14 days to figure this thing out. And trust and believe me, the Lady T is going to figure this thing out, y'all. Um, so, I'm, I got some stuff to do with it. We're going to figure it out. But I can tell y'all this. I clicked right here for anybody who's looking. I clicked right here. And it showed me printer status and then I finally started hovering over and seeing stuff but I'm just telling y'all this DTF thing seems to be a challenge I never saw I still have not seen white on any of the print head checks this is the print head check that I have I don't know how to turn the white ink on or off this is the configuration that I have, y'all, um, which is clear in here. Matte black um, is my, I mean, uh, photo black is my black. Uh, light black is my Cheyenne. Magenta is my light, light black. And so this is the yellow. So I don't know, because I still have not gotten, I have not seen like yellow on here, right? don't see any yellow coming on there but when I did this thing I'm starting to see some yellow here so I don't know um, also the other thing is I have not taken any rollers off of this thing I haven't taken nothing off I ain't took no rollers out or nothing I just put it on here and started printing so there there's the thing with and I guess that's why you see those lines in there uh, where the rollers are still on there we'll figure all of that stuff out I'm just trying to see if the colors are gonna come through so let's see it's been four minutes and it's a learning curve y'all it's a learning curve I'm definitely gonna say it's a learning curve I went and looked at a couple of videos. Um, I looked at a couple of D DTF Kingdom videos. I've looked at a couple of 
I looked at a big boy video where he said he was going to show how to print. Um, but I never seen him hit the print button. So, big boy, show us how to hit the print button. I didn't see anybody hit the print button. And I just started looking. I didn't know if I was supposed to rip this thing or just print it. So, I don't know, y'all. Um, but this is where we are in the DTF process. And y'all know your girl. I'm going to figure it out. I am going to figure it out. Um, not going to worry about it much on this first print. And I got to figure out how to get this paper to actually go through there, which is way, way thinner than the other paper that I use. So I'm working on it. It's a progress, a process. Um, I'm working on it. I'm trying to figure it out, right? We gonna get it popping. I don't know if I see. Well, I see some colors coming through, so it must be some ink. Must be some yellow ink off in there coming through somewhere. Now I don't know how to turn off. This is the thing, y'all. I don't know how to turn off this channel where I have cleaning solution in here. So I need to figure out how to turn this channel off so that I'm not using four channels of white, and then maybe my white will get brighter. But right now I have the white turned down really low. Um, so I don't know. Somebody help me. We'll figure it out. But we're gonna figure it out together. I'm gonna get it, y'all. I'm gonna get it. We're gonna get it. So right now I'm looking at it, it's kind of running and all that good stuff, but you know, hey, I'm gonna get it. I'm working on screen print film and everything, baby. One thing about a screen printer, baby, we don't play. We gonna get it. Y'all know what this thing is still printing. Well, dang, it's almost out of paper. Um, so it's almost supposed to be printing on a 13 by 19. And how does it know when it runs out of paper? I may have to do something to cancel that because don't look like it's too much more paper off in there. I didn't know it was going to print both pieces. So, um, I guess you got to set it up to make sure that. But that is the My Lady Print Ball space off in there. Somewhere off in there. It's My Lady Print Ball space. I didn't shake these inks up or anything, y'all. I just started printing. And y'all know me. A sister trying to figure it out okay and what I need to do right here is see it's still going and I'm out of paper so I'm gonna hit this cancel button right here and see if it's gonna cancel ain't nothing cancel it's still printing let me see if I can hit cancel or something right here abort that's what I'm going to hit, is abort, honey. Abort the print, abort the print, abort the print. <laughs> well, it aborted. That much it did do. Okay. And it's still saying print. But it did abort something. It stopped. Okay, I guess it's going to stop. I needed to abort the print, y'all. It's still saying printing. But it's moving over there like it's going to stop. And I'm just going to pull it on out. Because it's just stuck off in there. So this is my first DTF print, y'all. Y'all see those. I guess I do got to take those rollers out. I see one. I saw one lady said she didn't take her rollers out. And so the ink looks super, super wet and it's running. And maybe because I don't have anything down there also. So. But hey. That ain't too bad. That ain't too bad for my first try, right? Look at that, y'all. Look at that. That ain't too bad. Well, 
I see in the color right here, my um, shoes are still greenish, which are supposed to be yellow. And my blue right here is still blue. So I don't think all of my yellow is coming through yet. But baby, honey, I look like I've been crying and outside in the bad weather. It's kind of a greenish color, so I'm thinking that my yellow is coming through. Um, it's I know it had that cyan in it, that blue. So we're going to see y'all, but hey. That's, and again, like I said again, that's on film. That is on screen print film. And then white is basically dry. And that other color all these colors are just about dry on here hmm well we gonna figure it out we gonna figure it out that white is almost dry anyways so that's what that is that's the back side that's the front side that's how it would look we we moving forward we moving forward y'all we moving forward all right i'll see y'all in the next video tomorrow i guess um the printer is still saying print printing and I have aborted the print but it's still saying printing so I gotta figure that out bye